Well, you got to have sun to make solar power. And I had this spare 100 watt solar panel and solar charger laying around. So I decided, what the heck, I need to put it into operation here. Grab as much sun as I can. So I rigged it up here in the backyard with some MC4 pigtails and my little GT power analyzer making a whopping 3.2 watts. <laughs> Better than zero, I guess. But uh, that's what happens when you don't have sun. It's been like this for the past week. So I got this thing wired directly into the microsolar generator ammo can there. And the way I've got it hooked up is right with the 12 volt power socket there on the front. Check that out. Direct current, you know, no problem. So I'm just pushing power back in through the power socket. Easy peasy. Nothing to it. And I'm inverting a little bit, but you know, while we've not had great sun, I decided I'd rewire everything in there and spruce stuff up. And here's my little tool bag. That thing really works out great. Got a screwdriver and wire cutters and my little Larry Nebo flashlight. I keep in there. I keep my big ones in the truck now. I keep my little one in the little box. <laughs> and this is what I'm powering with the inverter. Just maybe a 20, 22 watt load TV. And I use that grill cover to cover everything up when it's drizzly, rainy. It works just perfectly. Keep everything dry. I also have a uh, Amazon Fire Stick on there too, so I can stream through the, their services. Really cool. All right, there you have it. Here's a little bonus video. Woohoo! Bonus video. Gotta love bonus videos in the uh, city. Coming and picking up my uh, tree trimmings, <laughs> solar suckers. All right, guys. I'll just let you enjoy the music, and uh, we'll see you next time, and I uh, hope you enjoy the video.